hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is nadisha so one of the ways that god speaks to me is through songs is through music and um so on sunday i was taking a nap and the song was in my spirit i'm on top of the world by imagine dragons and um i had to pull it up immediately because i don't really know this song <laughs> i just knew like one line okay which is i'm on top of the world <laughs> and uh so anyways i pull it up and the messages was like so profound so here it goes it says because i'm on top of the world i'm on top of the world waiting on this for a while now paying my dues to the dirt i've been waiting i've been waiting to smile been holding it in for a while take it um take me with you if you can been dreaming of this since a child i'm on top of the world okay this ties into so many of my messages i've i've done messages about how god um how god is going to exalt you um you know i also did a message about the world is down you're gonna be on top okay um I'm telling you, this is like, this will be confirmation for you, for uh, for some of you guys, right? I actually looked at the definition of on top of the world, what it meant. And it means to be happy, you know, and elated, you know, like just very ec ecstatic, you know. And um, yeah, you guys, you got, God is going to elevate you so much. God is going to elevate you to this point of like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain, but God is going to elevate you. God is going to exalt you. You know, he, you're going to feel on top of the world, not in a I'm better than you manner, not in a belittling manner, not in a superior manner, but just in a I'm really, really excited and I'm really, really happy. And and this is amazing kind of manner. OK, um, and I love how it says, you know, like I love how it says waiting on this for a while now okay you guys god has spoken promises so many promises to you he's given you visions and dreams and he has confirmed it with so many different um different signs and confirmations and prophecies and all that right and you've been waiting on this you've been whatever this is it could be multiple things you've been waiting for a while some people have been waiting months and some people have been waiting years okay years on these promises and you're holding god accountable to these promises you know it says waiting on this for a while now a lot a lot of you guys you know um You've been standing in faith and you've been believing God for the things that he has promised you. You know, it says pay my dues to the dirt. Listen, you guys have paid your dues. You've sown your seeds. You've uh, you, you've made so many sacrifices. You've walked paths. A lot of people would never walk. OK, you you have paid your dues. And yes, there is favor on your life. OK, but you've done the work. You've done the things that God had asked you to do. You, 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 you did it. You did the work. You sow your seeds and you will reap a harvest. You know, been paying, paid my dues for a while now. I've been waiting to smile, been holding it in for a while. Listen, man, you guys, your testimony is brewing. Okay. Your testimony is brewing. <laughs> you, you can't wait. You can't wait to share your testimony. Okay. You've been practicing your testimony. And, um, you know, you, you, you've already envisioned how this thing is going to, to, to work out, you know, clearly it's going to work out how God wants it to work out, but you know, you've already kind of like, kind of, kind of decorating it. It could, I don't know what it is for you, you know, but you've probably been decorating it. You've probably been putting, um, in your mind, you, you know, where certain things are going to go, you know, what pink color is going to be there. You know what I mean? Um, you know what you're going to wear, <laughs> whatever this is for you guys, because the sky's the limit here. God has made tons of promises, uh, to his children and, you can't wait. You can't wait for it. 
you know, been holding it in for a while. You can't wait to be this happy. You can't wait to, to live this life of freedom, you know? Um, and I love how it says, been dreaming of this since a child. <sighs> a lot of, a lot of, uh, for a lot of people, this, this will be confirmation for you. You've been dreaming of this since you were a child. God was the one who put that in your heart. God was, uh, God was the one who put that in your spirit. Okay. That, that dream that you have right now has always been there since you were a child and a lot of you guys can remember being five years old being six years old and you wanted to do that and you wanted to be that and you wanted to god put that in your spirit and you're gonna get your dream your dream will come true your dream will come true and you will be on top of the world you will be on top of the world you know um it says, I've tried to cut these corners, try to take the easy way out. I kept on falling short of something, but I kept on falling short of something. Yeah, like you can't cut corners with the Lord. <laughs> you can't, you know, you have to go through the process. You know, you have to go through the process that God uh, had laid out for you because what the process is, the process is building your character. The process is refining you. God is not going to give you the promise if your character can't maintain it okay so he had to build your character and then he'll give you the promise okay that's why he'll have you go through the process so you couldn't cut corners you know it says i could have gave i could have gave up then but then again i couldn't have because i've traveled all this way for something you know a lot of you guys felt like there was times where you felt like you wanted to give up you're like forget it i can't be bothered it's too hard it's too complicated you know, you wanted to give up, but somehow God kept reviving you. He kept giving you the strength to persevere, to endure, to keep going. You know what I mean? He, and then it's so funny because now you're at this place right now, and then you can look back into your past and you're like, how did I get, how did I do that? How did I do that? How did I, how was I able to do that for that long? How was I able to withstand that for that long? God's strength, <laughs> his peace, his mercy, his favor, his guidance, his protection over your life that allowed you to be able to be where you're at right now. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm telling you guys, a lot of you guys' dream is going to come true. It will it will, it will, it will, it will, it will. I need you to get very, very excited. You are going to feel on top of the world. Whatever it is that you've been believing in God for, he's going to do it. And you, it's going to make you so happy. Not that you are not happy right now, but you're going to just be so happy. I don't know what that is. House, spouse, a business a car, a child, health, wealth, uh, prodigals, children, prodigal children, prodigal anybody. I don't know what it is that you're believing in God for, but whatever it is, it will make you happy, happier, okay? And you are going to be elated. You're going to be like on top of the world. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.